This video will introduce how to 1. Import yearly summer temperature values from an NC file 2. Interpolate temperature point data and 3. Save the results to a GeoTIFF file To import an NC file, click a new matrix window Choose Menu, Data, Connect to File, NetCDF The settings enable us to import yearly summer data. Shift the data from 180E center to 0 center. Next, I will extract the European region. Add an ROI to the matrix stack. Double click on it. Specify the start and end coordinates. Right click on the ROI. Create a new matrix stack on the European area. Apply a color palette to the matrix stack. Next, I'll interpolate the matrices. Choose Menu, Matrix, Resize. The dialog enables you to expand, shrink, pad, or interpolate a matrix stack. Choose Interpolate. Eight interpolation methods are available. Choose by linear. Specify a density gridding to interpolate the matrix stack to get a finer one. Set recalculate to be auto. Apply a color palette to the matrix stack. The interpolation matrix stack is finer than the original one. Next, I'll extract the region by a shapefile of the European boundary. Drag and drop the shapefile to a worksheet to import it. Activate the matrix window. Add a region of interest to the matrix. Then, create ROI using the shapefile. Create a new matrix from the European boundary. Click on the edge of the matrix window to bring up the mini toolbar. Apply color palette. Change the color of the missing values. I'll save the matrices to a GeoTIFF file. From 2022B, we have provided an app to batch exports the matrices as a GeoTIFF file. You can download it from the App Center if needed. Click the icon when a matrix window is active. Matrices in the matrix stack are listed in the box. Specify the output folder. Specify GT model and vertical units for values in the longitude and latitude coordinates. Set angular and vertical units if you know them. If not, keep them as undefined. The average temperature in summer for each years are exported as an individual GeoTIFF file. We hope this video helps and thank you for watching.